If you're looking for a job, you may want to watch what you like on Facebook. Vladimir Dutier found that employers have a new way to figure out who they're likely to hire. Whether it's a Facebook video of a cat jumping through snow or a photo of a dwarf planet 250 million miles away, clicking the like button may cost you your next job. You had their resume, which was polished within an inch of its life. Peter Mollick says resume. social media activity has completely changed the way he screens potential employees for his New York-based consulting firm, Fahrenheit 212. The resume, while still useful, oftentimes is so retrospective. So what we use is the LinkedIn, all the social media outlets that are there to give us a more holistic perspective of the individual. Stanford professor Michael Kaczynski wants to take the screening process a step further. He uses a computer model to predict personality traits by analyzing what someone likes on Facebook. The surprising thing is that when you combine you liking Lady Gaga, you liking some books, uh, movies, and maybe comments made by your friends, then actually they can extract much more information from that. Based on the 86,000 Facebook users who participated in the study, the model concluded people who like Shakespeare and 2001 A Space Odyssey were more artistic. People who liked Ford Motor or Rush Limbaugh were more conventional. Liking boxing was a sign of being organized. People who liked vampires were more spontaneous. The data collection is being tested through a website called applymagicsauce.com. Right now, users have to give permission to allow access to their Facebook pages. If it does give us a better sense of who this person is, that's hugely valuable. This has privacy concerns uh, by experts, but Scott, the researchers say most of our activity online is already public. And so anything that you click casually is there for the world to see. Vlad, thank you very much.